Hi everyone, this is going to be your DF to DM love letter. Let's get started. Slowly but surely, we're going to find a way to make this all right. Things are going to be better sometime soon. I can feel it. We're always having all these fights because I think you're somewhere out there doing something you're not supposed to be. I'm always getting so insecure about everything and... I know that I've been starting to be more vocal about it. I'm coming out of hiding. I'm coming out of holding back my truths. I'm tired of being left in the dark by you and I'm tired of keeping you in the dark about how I feel. How I feel about all of this is that I do want to work on it. Keep making this do or die situation and act like I'm leaving. Well, the main thing is, I'm not exactly acting. I really am fed up with this situation. And it's gotten to the point where I've already started imagining my life without you. And I hate it. But I'm starting to feel like that's the only realistic viewpoint left. Being this separated from you has been reteaching me independence. It's teaching me who I am when I don't get what I want. It's teaching me that I can't get this fulfillment from the outside. I'm waking up to the reality that I don't have much to offer you and that this time, this moment in time, we need to be more fair to each other. And I realize that now more than ever is when we need to do that. We're going to have our son again. We're going to have it all. I still believe in it all for us. It's going to be a rough ride. There's going to be a lot of ups and downs. It's going to get a lot worse before it gets better. We don't have anything to show for it. For this connection. But we do know that life is worth living when you have connections like these. These decisions we got to make are not going to get any easier. The world around us is crashing. And this nature of ours is not solving our problems. It's just keeping us stuck. I think we're failing to really analyze our behavior and the pathway up until this point. We keep trying to conceal our true emotions for each other. They run so deep that it almost feels like we're stuck again. Think we're caught in between our emotions and our mind. Somewhere between that. We've been damaged so bad in the past that we can't, we can't even judge 
how pure this connection really is. We're ready to walk away from each other just so that we don't get hurt. We don't see that we are the ones being petty to each other. How I feel about it is that I feel like you're the petty one. You feel like that I'm the petty one. We're so self-absorbed that we haven't really understood that we have what it takes to make the whole plan work already. To me, you're like a sunflower. You represent the best friend I could ever have, I could ever think about. And sometimes it'll look like I'm not working on this. Maybe you just think that I'm shouting at you and then hiding from you, but that's not like that at all. And I'm sorry that I made you feel like that you weren't working on it either. It's just this deep-seated impatience. I just, I don't want to even look at myself. I just want to just get with you and get out of here. <laughs> That's the only thing I'm thinking about, and I know I'm not thinking straight. We're gonna become our wish, and we're gonna unite someday. I don't see that right now, only because I'm slowly realizing from me breaking down all of my miseries and pains. Instead of blaming you, I'm gonna actualize my dream. And I'm going to get back in my power and I'm going to come see you again. Maybe we'll go for drinks. I think we're going to have a great time. I miss you. And I love you very much. Bye.